Not far from Izium City Cemetery, hundreds of buried bodies. On one side, the graves of civilians. On the other, a mass grave containing the bodies of 17 soldiers. The discovery in the newly liberated city is casting renewed spotlight on Russia's potential war crimes. At the foot of this bombed building, civilians are informed of the graves. I'm shocked. We didn't know. They say civilians died in bombings here and that they buried the deceased in their gardens before Russian occupiers ordered them to dig the bodies up and took them away. In this newly freed city, organizations hand out food while civilians can share stories of what they saw. One Ukrainian says Russian soldiers doubled down on identity controls in the city, carrying around with them lists of wanted people. They asked me if I was in the army. They were looking for soldiers, for policemen. Civilians were arrested. And what happened to them? Speaking at the location where the bodies were discovered, Ukraine's government spokesperson for human rights said people suffered under Russia's occupation. We have confirmation that we know the place where people were tortured and sometimes killed. We know that they were brought here. Any accusations of war crimes in Izium are still to be confirmed with evidence. The bodies buried here will be exhumed to determine cause of death.